Hello fellowship geeks, Oceanwire buffs, and collectors out there, this is Kyle the Urban with another episode of From the Common Room Collection. You probably notice I'm not wearing my hat, well because it was actually it was hurting my head, so I took it off. You can probably still kinda of tell where the line is at where I was wearing it. So but uh, anyway. I got something really cool I want to show you from my personal collection. Ta-da! Probably thinking, what in the hell are these things? Well, I will show you. Or I, I will tell you. There's a little note on the back, and I'll tell you. It says, Alan, enclosed in this CD case are a few paint chips from the SSUS. The blue chip is from the top of one of her stacks. The red chip is from the red portion of one of her stacks. The black chip is from the hull. And the small silver one is from her radar mast. You can now say that you own a part of the SS United States. Enjoy, Russ. If you're wondering who Russ is, he's a good friend of mine. He's a collector. And he actually visited the ship several times in the early 90s before she was towed overseas to the Ukraine before she was completely gutted. Anyway, these are paint chips from the SS United States. As you can see here very well, the blue and red ones are from the smokestack, the black one is from the hull, and the little silver one is from her radar mast. And what I think is really cool from about this piece, unlike my, some of my other pieces, this is actually something that is directly from the United States. I mean, yeah, I have other pieces that came off the ship, but this is actually a piece of her. This is actually a part of her. So this is why I love this piece so much. Not really much really I can explain about it, though, except for the fact that it's paint chips. Really, except... Well, oh, yeah, that's right. I taped the CD case up so it didn't fall out. But anyway, if you was to look at the back sides of the red and blue chip, it has this ugly, pasty, like, mint green primer shit. And that was the primer that they used on the smokestacks, if you've seen early pictures before they completely painted. You would see pictures of it in this ugly green primer. Well, that has an ugly green primer on it. If you look at the paint chips, you can see layers. You can see layers of paint where they painted over, you know, over the years. You can see the layers of paint. And that's why I think it's so cool. I wonder how many layers of paint there is on there, though, but... Because if you look at the chip there, the blue chip, it's almost kind of blackened. Because it's a dark steel blue, but if you look at it from this angle here, you can actually see the real dark, deep, rich blue it was. Because it's kind of faded a little bit, and so is the red chip. And you can see the real pretty dark red it is right there. Because if you've ever seen pictures of the smokestacks in the United States, and I might even, you know, uh, put a link to a photo of the stacks of the ship on, in my description below so you can see it. Um... I mean they're beautiful. The colors of the the colors of the smokestacks are really beautiful. And um I love the smokestacks. You know what? I have a model somewhere of a I've got several models right here we go. Here's my Ravel model of the ship. Here's kinda of gives you an idea of what the smokestacks once looked like. See? There's an angle right there of it. And so these came from here. That black one came off that and the little silver one came from there. And so that is all I wanted to show you and this is a really really cool piece. So if you have any questions or comments leave them in the question comment section below. If you love the video hit a thumbs up on it and if you love my channel hit subscribe. Until next time this is your friend Commodore Urban saying have clear skies and fair seas and Smooth sailing with all of you.